So not only does Counterpath have you know, clients across mobile, desktop, and tablet, we also have an SDK that's available to customers as well. And this has really become very important, especially in, in light of the um, um, more recent uh, launch of, of technologies such as WebRTC. As we know, WebRTC is built into a browser, um, some browsers, and you're able to, to leverage that, that media engine, which is the heart of what WebRTC offers for applications and kind of insert communications into applications. What we found with the, with the, with the growth of, of, of WebRTC and the interest around WebRTC, um, um, better said, as we find that customers are looking to bring communications, whether it be voice, video, messaging, or presence, into applications that they might have today on a mobile device, where you don't see a lot of WebRTC today inside of an application. So they're able to take our, our BRIA SDK and quickly um, enable a, a voice, video, IM client right within their own application. So inserting the applications into an existing application or being able to create their own voice application, whether it be for certain verticals or, or even into the now popular Internet of Things, um, whether it be a kiosk type of, 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 of uh, deployment or, or refrigerator, whatever the case may be, you're able to quickly take the communications. And the great thing about our SDK is it's, it's SIP enabled and it's able to connect into the most popular platforms that exist today where you don't have that, for example, on, on the WebRTC side today.